Hey there. Today you're going to learn how you can set up tracing from N8N to Langsmith in just a few minutes. N8N is an AI workflow builder. It has this really nice interface where I can quickly string together a few nodes into a simple AI agent. You can start by testing out these workflows directly in this canvas. And then once you're happy with it, you can also set up external triggers to execute these workflows automatically. Now, whether you're just getting started building or if you already have an agent in production, it's really important to see exactly what's going on under the hood of your app and also to monitor its performance over time. That's where Langsmith comes in. Langsmith is the leading AI observability and evals product that we've built here at Langchain. Start by navigating to the Langsmith website and creating an account. Once you have an account, Navigate to the settings page and generate an API key. This is how we're going to connect N8N executions to Linksmith. I've set up a quick self-hosted deployment of N8N on render. And now we're gonna add that Langsmith API key that we just generated to the environment where we've deployed N8N. We'll also set a few other environment variables too. These will turn on tracing to Langsmith, specify the trace destination as our cloud instance, and also specify the project name in which these traces will be created. That's it. That's all we had to do to set up tracing from N8N to Langsmith. Now let's go ahead and see this in action. Here, I have a simple agent. Let's go ahead and send it a message. This agent is gonna run for a while here, but its execution logs are now getting traced to Langsmith. Let's go take a look. Like I mentioned earlier, Langsmith traces give you full visibility into exactly what's happening in your workflow or agent. I've navigated us to this N8N test tracing project, just like we said earlier. Clicking into this trace, we can see the exact request that our runnable agent made to OpenAI. We can see the model that was used. We can see the latency of each step and even how many tokens and how expensive it was. And we can see all of the other steps that our agent took given this input. Now that was our detailed tracing view, which is really helpful for debugging. But once our workflow is deployed to prod, we get immediate telemetry in this pre-built monitoring view as well. We can track the app's usage over time. We can be aware of any latency or error spikes, and we can also track our LLM usage and spending. And so to recap, you can connect N8N to Langsmith in just two quick steps. One, generate a Langsmith API key, and two, set that API key in the environment where you've deployed N8N. That's it. Thanks for watching.